Assalamu alaikum dear students. Hope you are well by the grace of Almighty Allah. Welcome to NIEDS Home School. This is Fatima Kijona, Assistant Teacher of Islamic Studies, National Ideal English Version School, Monish. Dear students, today I am going to take a class for the students of class 6. And our today's topic is assignment. It is assignment number 3. We will discuss about the assignment that how you will do the assignment. Okay, this YouTube class will be helpful for you to do the assignment nicely to get excellent. How you will get excellent? Okay, now the student is at our class. It is assignment number 3 and lecture number 2. You have seen this is the assignment. You have gotten this instruction in your room. Okay, here is the assignment. Here is the description of your assignment. The main task of your assignment it is here. It is the task or doing thing. First, this assignment is different from other assignment. Okay, students, listen to me carefully. This assignment is different from the other assignment because be, before doing the assignment, you have to read this lesson, ch chapter, chapter 3, this lesson 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. These 5 lessons you have to read very carefully before doing this assignment. These five lessons you have to read at home very carefully. After reading these things, then you have to collect two person, two person at your home. Okay, you have to collect two person. He or she will recite Surah Fatiha with meaning. It is the main task. Here is the task. Okay, collect two person. He or she will recite Surah Fatiha with meaning in front of you, and you have to identify the problem. What problem? or what mistakes he or she has done and what is the um, missing of pronunciation and missing of makhra, sifat and the uh, uh, continuation of surah fatiha, meaning of surah fatiha, whether he or she skip any line or not, something like that. So you have to collect, after reading this five lesson, you have to collect two person, then you, after listening their recitation with meaning, then you have to identify that what problem he or uh, she done. Then identify the makras, whether she or he done makras nicely, correctly or not, sifat. Then uh, uh, meaning of surah fatiha correctly, continuation are there or not. Okay, with the help of your book, you have to give the advice. Where is the problem? Give the advice. Where is the problem or where is the mistake? Uh, misconception done by his or him or her okay so you have to uh, identify the mistakes then give the advice it will be like this the pronunciation will be like this and here is the problem and uh, this uh, here you have to give the advices and if it is done nicely then you have to give the importance of tasbih makras tilawat quran with from this lesson okay if it is done nicely then you have to give the advice about that importance of tilawat makras tilawat tajibit and makras all these things and if it is wrong anywhere then you have to identify that where it is wrong understand and uh, how you have to pronounce it like this okay then identify the problems what you have faced to perform the task this two after doing these two things it may be two paras within this here two or three paras here two or three paras in this instruction in here after uh, completing these two you have to do these things identifying the problem what you have faced to perform the task okay what kind of problem you have faced what kind of problem you have to uh, enlist these things that you have uh, faced this kind of problem to do the task and mention what we have learned to perform the job then what is the learning it will be the another pair what what we what you have learned the learning of you to perform the job okay and individuality and creativity should be present in your writing understand so uh, doing this task or uh, doing the assignment the individuality and creativity should be over there and follow the instruction very carefully all of the instruction to get excellent understand if you follow all of the instruction then you will get excellent and here in your book here you will get the description of makras tajweed and surah al fatiha with meaning and tilawat importance of tilawat all and here the distinctiveness of al quran 
all these things you will get in your book with the help of these things you will judge the person then you will give the advice and you have to present it in your assignment understand new students i hope that you have understood this lesson very carefully it is different from other assignment you have to uh, take uh, knowledge from this five lesson first then you have to do the task of the assignment present nicely and individuality creativity should be over there okay that's all for today is real if you have any question about the assignment about anything you can ask me in live class thank you assalamu alaikum